previously on TJ Laser. I'm Dr. Garrett Bryson, and this is Task Force Aurora. I was ordered to come here. How can you help pwn the Reapers? Hadley, do you have the data? Incoming data. No! <laughs> He's got a freezer! Whatever it is, I believe Leviathan is nothing less than a Reaper killer. Damn it, I'm Bryson, listen. Your father was pwned. Killed by incoming data. I need to know what's on the other end of that artifact. What he died for. Commander, new readings from the pro. Hall. It's narrowed down Leviathan's location. Not under the water. Looks that way. Jumping in space C in three, two, one. TJ Laser! Okay, this is TJ Laser. Underwater space log number one. Not sure if you can hear this communication, but record it if you can. Future generations will want to hear this. But this is one small step for man, one giant leap underwater. In case I don't make it back, I want Lieutenant Williams and Liara to know I love them both equally in my own way. Not as much as I love T.T. Deezer, but close. Liara once asked about my father, T.T. Deezer Sr., but I didn't want to talk about it. My father was a bar fighter, horror fucker, super masculine spaceman. I was an orphan, so I never knew him as a child, but I heard the space stories growing up. He'd send space checks now and then. I don't remember my mother. She died when I was a space baby. All I wanted was to be loved for God's sake. I might put up a macho act, but all I want is to be loved, to be held. Oh, there is my space probe. I must be close. Oh, movement! The space penis rises. Arise, space penis. Creature, can't we coexist? Can't there be a peace between us? This is not your domain. You have breached the darkness. You pwned a reaper. Why, if they're your buddies? They are the enemy. One that seeks our extermination. Oh, visions! Wait, I thought you were an underwater space penis reaper thing. They are only echoes. We existed long before. What the fuck are you? Something more. No! Infiltrating the mind of T.T. Deezer! Your mind belongs to me. It can't be! Breathe! No, I belong to nobody! Huh? And right, huh? What's happening? Your memories give voice to our words. Your nature will be revealed to us. Accept this. You pwned a reaper, as did I. Let's work together as a unit. There is no war. There is only the harvest. There is no Dane or only Zul. None have possessed the strength in past cycles. Your own species can be destroyed with a single thought. But you... Are different. I have witnessed your actions in this cycle. Standing in defiance against the Reapers. They perceive you as a threat. And I must understand why. Huh? Oh. Over time, the species built machines that then destroyed 
made what I call a key bumbo. Why? He cannot conceive of a galaxy that bends to your will. Every creature, every nation, every planet we discovered became our tools. We were above the concerns of lesser species. The intelligence was envisioned as simply another tool. Now we all pay the price for your bumble? There was no mistake. It still serves its purpose. What do you think of the teaching these here clone planet idea? We have watched its construction before. It has never been completed. Those who have tried still fell victim to the harvest. This time they're sex slave babes though. I bet those other life cycles didn't have that. Each harvest ends with the birth of a reaper. Perfect in its design. Each formed in Harbinger's image. Our image. Each reaper has Ah, you're knowledge. boring me now. This overexposition is monotonous and I could care less. Let's stop this cycle garbage for once. Team up and let the TJ Daisy clones rule the universe. I have searched your mind. You are an anomaly, yet that is not enough. Wait! The cycle will continue. No! You've had visions! You know this time the universe is TJ Lee's room we can fight back! We will survive. You will remain here as a servant of our needs. Huh? The Reapers will harvest the rest. TJ Laser is no one slave. I'm the one with the slave babes, you dopey space slug cunt sucker. Get me back to the surface and watch as the TJ Laser Club babies flourish. Nothing will change. Yes, it will. Damn it, I am tired of weakness. You have no idea what men of power can do. This is your bumble. Every previous genius with the Clone Planet scheme failed because you didn't have the moral courage to stand with them. The Reapers are fiercely jealous of TJ Deezer. A handsome man like that, do you understand? Suppose we move the TJ Clone Planet to this planet. The Reapers will go looking for me where I was, and you can assume the rest. Come on, help me out. If you don't help me, the Reapers will turn on you, and I'll win. I'm TJ Deezer, winner of most confident 10 years running. It's clear why the Reapers perceive you as a threat. Your victories are more than a product of chance. We will fight, but not for you or any lesser race. We were the first, the Apex race. We will survive. Oh. And the Reapers who trespass on this world will understand our power. from the depths. By the way, if you did record my transmission earlier, I want it deleted. That's an order. The decompression made me confused. I didn't know what I was saying. Ignore it all.
snap out of it. He's freezing. Dad! Oh, Dad! <laughs> you okay? Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Never better. I'm TJ Laser, remember? Never do that again. I've got Anne Bryson on the comp. Anne Bryson? What does she want? Commander. What is it, bitch? What happened? I found Leviathan, Anne. Was it worth it? It wasn't. After all the excitement, it was just an underwater space dildo. Sounds like an amazing story. Are you listening to me? It was garbage. Exposition dullness. Shit DLC content. My father would appreciate this, knowing the truth is out there. In the meantime, Admiral Hackett has asked me to join his scientific team. We all have our part to play. I should get to it. Yes, you should, Ad. And never darken TJ Laser's door again. Commander, I finished reading your report. Pretty dull, huh? I fell asleep writing it more than once. Our people will be studying it for years to come. They're already calling it the Leviathan Codex. Losers. It rewrites galactic history as we know it. What it tells us is that this universe is full of pretentious cunts who waffle on and on with exposition dialogue that sends you to sleep. I'm sick of it. That's one way to look at it. I guess it's the only way. At least we've got the underwater space dildos helping us. This is a big step in the right direction, Shepard. Good work. TJ Laser out. Hack it out.